you remember a fortnight ago we were here when uh, the DCI and the ODPP brought Nick Mwendwa in court seeking to be given more time to hold him as they continue investigations on uh, alleged malpractices and abuse of office at FKF. The court uh, agreed with them in part and released uh, Nick Mwendwa on uh, cash bail and gave them a limited period of time to promote those investigations. If at all there were such investigations, then make a decision when or not to charge him. Today was a mention when the DPP and the DCI were to indicate to court whether they finished their investigations and if they had any charges to prefer against the government. Of course, as expected, no charges were preferred and the DPP notified the court that they have closed the file. A confirmation that Nick Mendoa had been arrested, detained on flimsy and trumped up charges. Because if there were any charges, nothing would have been easier than to mount them today. But it speaks to something wider than the arrest, detention, and the detentions charge of Nick Mendoa. It speaks to the management of FKF and the so called caretaker committee. If the caretaker committee was set up, Fundamentally, on account of the claims that Nick Mendoa had abused his office and was suspected to have stolen money from FKF, then that caretaker committee would not be there in the first place. Nick Mendoa has been vindicated. That is the conclusion we take from what has happened to court in court this morning. File means that the investigations have concluded. There is no criminal culpability against the court. Understand. So there are no criminal charges. We will move 